If you enjoy this reading, please subscribe and give us a like. Thank you. Here's Mrs. Small's new book. Look under Show More for more information. Ready, Set, Hop by Stuart J. Murphy, illustrated by John Fuller. We're going to come back to this page later. Ready, Set, Hop. Ready, set, hop! Maddie and Mo are two happy frogs. They like to play on rocks and make rafts from tiny logs. This is Maddie. This is Mo. One day, Maddie bragged to Mo, I'm a very tall frog. I bet I can hop longer hops than you. But Maddie croaked Mo. I'm a very big frog, and I hop long hops, too. Let's find out, said Maddie. I bet I can get to the big rock in fewer hops than you, because my hops are longer. Hmm. But my hops are bigger, said Mo. I'll go first and show you. He stretched his large legs and started hopping. It took him five hops to get to the big rock. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five hops. That's right. Mo croaked. Now see if you can beat that. Ready, said hop. It took Maddie two hops more than it took Mo to get to the big rock. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven hops. So five and seven. How many hops did it take Maddie to get to the rock? It took Mo five hops. One, two, three, four, five. Oh no, he starts here. One, two, three, four, five. It took Maddie two hops more than it took Mo. Five plus two equals how many? Five plus two equals one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Hmm. I can't believe it, said Maddie. You took fewer hops. So you're ahead so far, but now let's hop to the hollow log. Mo wasn't worried. He knew he would hop longer hops. It took him seven hops to get to the log. So he starts here. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then when he lands, seven. Okay, Maddie, it's your turn. Ready, set, hop. One, two, three, four. Maddie hopped three hops fewer than Mo to get to the log. Hmm. He tried hard. How many hops did it take Maddie to get from the rock to the log? It took Mo seven hops. It took Maddie three hops less than it took Mo. Seven minus or take away three equals how many? Seven minus three equals what? Seven minus three equals four. One, two, three. Maddie said, we were each ahead one time, so we'd better try once more. Okay, said Mo. Watch how few hops I take to get to the pond. After you, Mo, said Maddie. With seven long hops, Mo reached the pond. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
five, six, seven. Look at these guys hopping now. Haha. <laughs> Come on, Maddie, yelled Mo. Ready, set, hop. Maddie hopped and hopped. He hopped two hops more than Mo, but he should have stopped and hopped one less. Oh, he landed right in the water. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, doink, nine. Ah, oh, Mo's laughing. Everybody's laughing. How many hops did Maddie take to get from the log to the pond? How many should he have taken? It took Mo seven hops. He got to the pond and didn't go in. It took Maddie two hops more than it took Mo, but he should have stopped one less. See, he went too far. He should have stopped here. Seven plus two equals how many? Let's find out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So seven plus two equals nine, but we want to take one away so he doesn't go in the water. Minus one. One less than nine is nine minus one equals how many is that? Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Very good. The answer is eight. Mo croaked. The contest is over. Let's add up all our hops and see who won. Mo counted. I hopped five hops to get to the rock, then seven hops. Seven more to the log and seven more to the pond. That gives me 19 hops. Maddie said I hopped seven and four and nine. That makes 20 hops in all. It looks like you finished with one hop less than me. So, Mo, you're the better hopper. Yeah, pretty even to me. One less. I won. But all that hopping made me hot, croaked Mo. Watch out, I'm hopping in. Doink. Maddie said, if you took one more hop, he's thinking this, 19 plus 1 equals 20. Ooh, that's fun. Then both of us will win. There's the goal. Go swimming. What's some math here? Oh, we have some fun math. Three frogs plus two more frogs. What does that equal? Three frogs plus two more. Five. Here's one, two, three, four. Four frogs looking that way. Minus one frog looking that way. That means we take away one equals what? Three. Four minus one equals three. Here's two plus two. That's adding equals what? Two plus two. It's one less than five. Four! And, ooh, here's a lot of peekaboo frogs. One, two, three, four, whoops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we're going to take away, that's minus three. We have eight. We take away three. That leaves five. All right. He's thinking about something good to eat. So is he. He's thinking about five flies. One, two, three, four, five. Plus, this frog is, is thinking about one, two, three, four flies. What does that equal? Five plus four. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
time. We could make it easier and say five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yay! One, two, three hops plus one hop. Now you can figure that one out. How about this? Five, six, seven, eight, nine plus. Oh, they're exact. Oh, no, they're not. There's four on the bottom. So there's nine here. Let's count these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten plus nine. Well, if we know ten, ten and ten make twenty. We need one less than 20. Let's take away one. So that's 10 plus 9. That's 19. 1 and 9 together. Very good. Thanks for watching, friends. I hope you enjoyed that. Head over to Math and Science Playlist for more. See you soon.